Hey guys, before we start the video, I want to say that I changed the format of the tutorials. If you like this new format or maybe even dislike it, feel free to tell me in the comments below. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Doombreaker again and I'm here with another tutorial for you guys. So today's tutorial was requested by a user that asks how to change the picture of his picture box by clicking a button on his form. So we are going to start off by dragging all the necessary tools from the toolbox. So we start off by dragging in the picture box and making it a little bigger. And then we are going to drag in two buttons by double clicking the button twice. Once that is out of the way we are going to position them just the way we want to. Next up, we are going to change the text of the buttons. This is completely optional by the way. Next up, we are going to import the images from your documents into our program. You do this by going to the project properties. You can do this by either right clicking on your project name and going to properties or you can press alt enter. Once you're there, you go to the left and you click on resources. Then you will see a button that says add resources. Click the little arrow next to it and then click add existing file. Then you can just browse into your documents and find the images you want. Then click on them and press open. Then you can exit out of that and click yes to save all your images. Now comes the coding part. Double click each button to generate its sub. We're almost there. In the sub, type picturebox image is equal to my.resources. and the name of your image file. Mine is extremely long, but yours might be shorter. Alright, we're done. Now all that's left to do is debug it to see if it works. Alright, it looks like it works. All I'm going to do now is change the picture box so you can see the whole image instead of just the corner of it. Alright, that's all for today's tutorial. If you liked the video, please click the like button below. If you like my stuff, consider subscribing because it helps me out a lot. And I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.